how to program a PLU with a preset description and price on the Casio SES 400. First of all, turn the PGM key down to the PGM mode, arrow down to PLU setting, and then press the cache mount 10 button. If you're programming in a specific PLU number, for example 99, you can now type that number in and then press cache. Alternatively, if you just press cache and don't enter a number, it will bring up PLU number one. You'll be in the same list of PLUs, but just at the very start. Once you've found your PLU, so we've got 99 highlighted, you press cache amount tend, and that brings you into the settings for this button. So price is highlighted, so we might as well start there. We're going to program it at £1. There's no need to enter the decimal point. You just type in the numbers of the price and the till will put the decimal point in the right place. The description is the top line, so we arrow up to it. We can delete the default Casio description, PLU00099, and then whatever we type in now is what appears when that PLU is sold. It'll appear on the receipt and also on screen. You can enter the descriptors using either the numeric buttons, which have got the letters on, or if it's a straightforward description in capitals, I prefer using the department keys. So we call this I don't know, let's call it tool. Tool space A. So we've got that preset. We can attach it to a department. So say for example, we had a department tools group. We scroll down and say that was department number one. We type in one there and that's that set up. If it was going to be an open PLU, so a PLU without a price attached to it, so a variable PLU, that's controlled on the next line down. We'll keep things simple with this one and press subtotal. We can then scroll down and program a different PLU or if we're happy with our PLU settings, we've, we've amended the one we wanted to do. Then you simply press subtotal, subtotal again until you're back to the main PGM menu with all the settings. And at this point you can turn the key back to the reg mode tear off what should happen if you're in receipt mode you'll get a printout confirming the programming that you've done and then to sell PLU 99 you type in the number and then press the PLU button and it comes with the preset price and preset description. For more information please visit casiohelp.co.uk. Thanks for watching.